about 75 miles from Chicago, a world record attempt is underway. It's being played out not on the ground, but in the air. Dozens of skydivers gathering in Ottawa to set this record. WGN's very own resident skydiver, Jackie Bang, is there. I'm at Skydive Chicago in Ottawa. This is day three of the world record attempt. They are trying to build the world's largest vertical formation. What is that? Let's take a look. We're trying to link up 200 people, utilizing 10 airplanes, going to 19,000 feet. Now, unlike normal skydiving where you're falling belly to earth, we're actually doing this upside down, so our heads are pointing towards the earth, and we're doing about 180 miles an hour. This is good. One, two, there's the third. Skydive Chicago owner Rupe Nelson is at the helm of this record. After each jump, he and team captains review the aerial footage. I believe it was one of the biggest formations we've done thus far. Congratulations. Among the elite athletes is Mickey Nuttall. At 53, he is the oldest member of the team. Uh, it feels great, you know. Um, I'm stoked that I've been able to jump this many years. I started 30 years ago. So uh, age is just a number, you know. Right next to him, 19-year-old Pedro Carnero, the youngest athlete. It's been pretty amazing being here, like seeing things when I was younger from YouTube, seeing the first world record happen, and like that's where I want to be, and now getting to be here with guys like Mickey and, you know, guys that I've looked up to my whole life. This is a diagram of the formation presented to the International Parachute Governing Body, the FAI. To get the record, skydivers have to recreate it. This is the third attempt of the day, the 12th since they began on Monday. No record yet, but these skydivers, some of whom come from halfway around the world, are not frustrated. It's building, it is almost built. We're on, on the last layer, it's, it's so close. It's so close. It just oh, yeah. The last record was in 2015 with 164 skydivers. After seven years, no one is giving up. It's so good to have everybody back here, all of the international friends back here, and there's still a lot of energy, even though we're not getting close to a completion. Uh, spirits are still high, and I think we're ready to get it done. At this point, no record set, but they are going to continue to try this evening as well as the next two days. Jackie Bang, WGN News.